hope. Wait till you see this next top. This blouse, you don't have to tuck it in. It hits you at the narrowest little part of your waist, floats away. Isn't that a magic little top it's with a skirt a like this? It's a perfect little skimmer with yeah. a little skinny jean, with any kind of the jeans, with the skirt, and it's you can tuck it in, so it becomes a perfect little crepe sure. blouse. Oh yeah, almost like a t like a dressier t-shirt. But I spent a lot of time getting that curve. Right, how it goes down and curves around the hip. And it just makes for, again, again, I think anytime you curve on a woman's curvy body, Absolutely. good things happen. Makes her waist look tiny. Oh, yeah. It's so pretty. And I love and the sleeve. so easy to wear. This is, again, it's easy to care for. You throw this in the washer, you throw it in the dryer. It's a poly spandex. There's 4% span in this, so it has a little bit of stretch. It does. Orchid black, white, or actually it's an off-white or twilight are the color choices. 27 inches long, and that's at the longest point. In the front, you can see it crops up a little bit just to give you beautiful shape. If you're curvy, you will love this. If you're straight, if you're not real curvy. Oh, for sure. This, this kind of gives you some curves. Especially the weight of this fabric. And I, I did a trick that I've done before is that I've made the hems on the cuffs and the hem on the bottom a little heavier. Yeah. So it really does help. It helps that th this little skimmer just hang hang down nicely. Instead of floating away yes. and kind of expanding you, it really hangs down and drapes. I noticed and I that like about your tops in general. You must, you, you think about that. They, it's they the weight. drape, they hang beautifully. The way, it's sometimes, sometimes with certain fabrics on certain cuts, I just need a little bit extra weight to have them hang correctly. Yeah. And it makes the it biggest difference does. in the world. And it just looks more expensive this way. For Look at sure. the little, this is the back. There's a little keyhole closure in the back with a little dye to match button. This orchid color, by the way, isn't that a beautiful is color? beautiful. And I love off that. to the phones we go. Listen to this. Sarah is calling in from Louisiana. Sarah owns 15 pair of Melissa's jeans. Oh my gosh. Hi, Sarah. You're live Hi. with Melissa. Hi. First, I want to say to Melissa that uh, I was a fan before she made jeans, <laughs> uh, but now I'm a sold out fan of those jeans. And the reason I own 15 pair, when I heard the lady say that she owned seven, I went, ha ha. <laughs> I actually went to the closet and counted and oh. the pair of jeans, and I said 14 at first, then the pair of jeans that Melissa has on right now, I missed them. So I no, no, I have 15 pairs because when they come out, the new arrivals, you know, we savvy HSN shoppers know when right. new arrivals come, we oh hit that my. thing at 7 o'clock every morning to see what's on. And I kept waiting for Melissa's new line to come out because I own, <laughs> the reason I own 15, let me back up, is because I buy duplicates. I never want to be without those jeans. And my point, too, is that I'm a 4'6", not not a, you know, 14, 16, 18, 20, my sister is. But I'm a 4'6", and it is the devil to find jeans that fit well. I think it's the devil to find jeans that fit anybody well. It's you just, it's a, right. tri it's a tricky thing, and I think they've been cut kind of straight up and down for, for the fellas for too long, and, and it doesn't matter what size you are, you still need it to fit your body well, and I can't believe you have 15. That's Girl, fantastic. I threw out every other jean I had. And I love the distressed ones because, you know, I'm I'm senior uh, and I travel with a chicky group and everybody wants those jeans. Sarah, and did you so get... So I have to get on HSN, but, you know, those those smaller sizes sell out pretty quick. So they've been mad at me because I have It's because you're buying all of them. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> now we know why they're all selling out, Sarah. It's your oh, fault. Oh, my Tell gosh. Me. I love it. I am on it. those jeans. When I, the distress ones were so great, uh, and I said, well, let me just go back and get another pair because I never doubt them. And it was hard to get them, so I would wait and watch, and sure enough, they would come back in. So, oh Melissa, gosh. don't ever <laughs> stop making jeans. I'm not. I, I, you, you, you will seriously keep me in business. <laughs> Baby, I'll, I'll keep making them for you. Let's go for like 40. <laughs> <laughs> Pardon? I said, we'll go for 40. Look, I'm, I'm there. I'm all about it. I have a few of your tops, but I am absolutely Okay, so now we've jeans. started a little competition oh my gosh, here, that's Sarah. So great. I want to know if anybody can top Sarah. Here. Yeah, oh. look, you, you need to get that rock and, uh, and let's see who can top me on that. 15 pair. <laughs> Oh, and by the way, oh no, I take it back. I had two of the white pair just delivered about an hour ago from oh. Ups, so I'm about to open the white pair to see what how they fit. So is so, that 16? 
Oh, that will they'll be 16. Uh, let's see, 50. Yeah, they'll make 17. Oh, jeez. So see, oh, here we go. <laughs> here we go. All right, well, the competition oh is on. You've thrown down the gauntlet. Yes, you've thrown down the gauntlet. You're the one to beat. <laughs> Oh my gosh, that's great. Sarah, your enthusiasm you so you much. is so appreciated. You are so cute. Enjoy <laughs> all of your fabulous jeans. You know, again, I love these calls because it helps to oh reinforce what every single one of us are saying. When I'm chatting with the models backstage and we are all flipping out going, don't you love these? Don't you love these? We're all like really excited to get to wear a jean that we all will truly buy, that we really do buy and, and enjoy that's in our wardrobe. It's amazing to hear. And I do. I, I mean, I, I have a lot of people wear them and I have a, a lot of friends that I have wear them that will be very, very honest with me. And, uh, and that's what I want. I always want. I always want to hear real feedback. That's why I wear every single thing all day or a couple days to see, is it comfortable? Does it wear well? So when I hear something like that, that just, I mean... That's like, it's too much of a good thing. That's fantastic. It's so great. And here, look at Hope in a pair of the Melissa jeans with this adorable high-low crop top. She's wearing the orchid. I love, I love that the color. Orchid. I wow. love that orchid. You look amazing. And this was something I found I was missing because I was making everything longer because it's usually what I wear. Right. But then I would have certain things on and I thought... I don't really have anything shorter right yeah. now. And also, see, what I love is that so That's often so I'm doing a half tuck. Right, because right. I like the le little length in the back. I like that drape. So I'm doing it a little tuck in the front. Well, you, it's like this you, is it's done. It's you so throw clean it on and you and get simple. that. It's really feel. really easy. Because look at how adorable that looked with her jeans. And here you can see how great it looks with the skirt on Melissa. You can see also on Jamie how great this is with the cocoon over it or little topper over it. This is a wonderful piece for layering. You know, that's the other thing is that this is the time of year when we are layering and then as it gets warmer, that topper is going to come off and she just has on this beautiful top underneath. And also these are very accessory friendly because we all love to add our own jewelry and our own bag and, and make it, it really our own. And it really pops. Like I, I, do, I do like something just below the elbow. You show the nicest, you show yeah. like the prettiest part of the, of the arm and show a little skin here and then your jewelry can really you you're can, right you can really see it yeah you can so that's what i think is nice about pieces like this and also when you touch it there's a there's a wonderful hand to this it has a little hint of texture in it you can see on the girls how beautifully it drapes the neckline is flattery it's not too low you know i think that's always sort of an issue for a lot of women i think that you're very cognizant of not ever making these necklines i am too low. i want to open up the face i want to see a little skin but i you know it's never good if you're you're fighting it all you're day. right or having or having to wear a tank i have so many tops where i, I have, don't yeah. have a choice i don't I have, have to. to right exactly yeah this is this is a, a you know this is new this spring and i felt like it was the piece i was missing and then the more i looked around at my things i thought i just need a simple little t-shirt that's a little elevated and this is i'm really happy with it mm -hmm. look at this with a really pretty pendant just a long swing style necklace there's that blue by the way we call that twilight blue it's not really a navy it's just a really beautiful like it's inky yeah like it's the, an inky pretty pretty blue i love it and then is jamie's topper coming up i love that little topper i know we have a kimono coming up later on that i think i might throw on that that might be it i love all of these easy there's that one and the floor Floral. That's. I think the you purposely do everything kind of mixes and matches, doesn't it? I, I'm a big, big fan of mixing prints. I think I think it can really be done so easily. I think that floral ponte skirt and that that kimono topper she's wearing, the black and white with a white or black t-shirt, you put those prints together and all of a sudden the whole thing becomes really snappy and happy. It just, it really elevates it. So I love prints. I, I encourage everybody to wear your prints together. Exactly. And by the way, oh, you've got to be kidding me. Oh, my gosh. So, the, really, the competition is on now. What? Oh, this is oh getting hilarious. So, now we have a tweet coming in <laughs> from somebody. This is Andrew is telling us, ha, ha, got that lady beat. My mom's got 19 pair of oh. Melissa's jeans and 15 tops. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I can't even believe oh. that. <laughs> Oh, That's you have to amazing. call now. You have to keep calling. Oh, my calling. gosh. Please call. That's amazing. <laughs> 19 pair. That, That's pretty good. That is, that's amazing. That's, that's remarkable. Three weeks worth. Oh, my gosh. Oh, really? I know. I want to know, like, how do, do you rotate them? But how you are know, you? People do live in jeans. Do you wear jeans almost every day? I mean, a lot I, of us well, wear I'm, jeans. I'm switching, but I, I mean, I'm probably in jeans th three days a week, four yeah. days a week. Right. 
I mean, which was, I never thought I would say that, but then I'm switching, you know. And it's I'm thanks to your own jeans, Ponte. right? I mean, yeah. that's it, it's thanks to. I haven't worn another pair of jeans now in, you know, two years. That's wild. Just no, because that's I great. really can't, like all of mine. Why would you? Away. I just am right? not, I'm not that comfortable in them. Exactly. Oh, girls, I mean, people would not be, now we have somebody who bought 19.